Hi guys, it's uh, NM Kafour here with the Galaxy S3 smartphone. We're going to take a quick look at the copy and paste functionality within the Android operating system. Now, this S3 is running Android Ice Cream Sandwich version 4.0. As you can see there, it's Android 4.0.4. Uh, an ice cream sandwich so anyone that uses a PC will know what the copy and paste functionality is when you copy text from one location and put it into another location hence pasting it in now first of all we're going to a text message and just show you this if we go into that one from our network provider you've got the text there now if you want to copy the entire text and just put it in say another location what you can do is hold it down and you've got copy message text now, in this example I'll show you I'm just going to paste it in the reply. So hold it down, and you can see you'll get a sub menu pop up saying paste or clipboard. Hit paste, and it copies the entire text again, as you can see there. Now, what we'll do, we'll just delete that again. Now, this just doesn't work from within a text application itself, it can work into any application. So, if I go into, say, uh, a Word document, uh, here we go, and uh, say hold it down and hit the paste button, there you go, it's got the the text message copied and pasted all of it in go to the end and go through the same process deleting it and it holds it up there we go now what we'll do we'll go back to the same text message again and if we want to not copy the entire text message again but just specific text so hold it down so you go inside of the the text message and uh, say just hold it down to a particular section you'll get two crosshairs a beginning and an end now select what you want to begin so I'll do I'll do we're giving you I'll copy that and then in the top right of the screen you'll see two uh, pages together hit those and then it'll say copy to clipboard then go back into the text message again I'm going to just symbolize that it's it works hold it down and then you've got the paste function there and it says we're giving you there again I'll show you into the another application so go into the word document again hold it down and hit the paste button and it says we're giving you so you can it doesn't matter what application you do it from or what where you do it to as long as the text is copied to the clipboard it will work so we'll just get rid of that as we did before And then another one I want to show you is from a website. That's what I did uh, the BBC website. So we'll just go into an article. Uh, that's not will do. So just got an article mainly about text. And there you go. So what we'll do, just hold down a part of the area that you want to copy, and you've got some crosshairs that come up. Say so if I want to copy that entire top line, just set the starting point and then the end point. So if we lead it there, where it says in the meantime the taxes are loaded. Then along the top you've got two pages just symbolizing that it's a, uh, the copy function. So you hit copy and that's now copied it to the clipboard. And what we'll now do, go into a Word document that I've got open there. Or a Google Doc should I say. Hold down the no, empty space, hit paste and then you can see it says in the meantime the taxes are loaded. Exactly how it copied from the website. I'll just show you again like it's across multiple apps will go into the text message so hold it down and then hit paste now if like that it doesn't work because sometimes it doesn't depending on the type of text it is from websites hold it down and go to clipboard it tells you everything that's uh, been saved to the clipboard as in copy and paste functions and you, there you go you can see it says in the meantime the taxes are loaded just hit that and as you can see it puts it straight into the text message there so if the paste doesn't work just go into the clipboard as I did there and just tap on whichever one you want to paste in now that's a copy and paste function on S3 you can also copy and paste uh, pictures music files stuff like that so what you can do is if I go into my file explorer and go into my just uh, the standard file explorer uh, the root of the SD card on the Galaxy S3 I've got two files there, text files. What you can do, say if I want to copy that text file, hold it down until it says copy. Hit copy. And say if I want to put it somewhere on my external SD card, just navigate to where you want to put it. I'll put it straight on the root of the SD card. Now this time when I go back, say, there you go. I'm at the root, so if I want to go to the external SD card, 
and you can see there's the document I copied across which says C330 360 rather underscore debug I'm just going to remove it because I don't need it excellent so if we go back again same to the SD card of the phone the storage of the phone this works regardless of what type of format the, the, the file is in so it could be a picture, a movie, a music file, anything at all and there you go I've got the Dark Knight Rises trailer there so again hold it down until it says copy and then it, it wants to know where do you want to save it to the copied version that is so if I put it on the SD card at the moment you can see there's nothing there on the external SD card so if I hit done you should then copy it across now that's a uh, a little bit bigger than the text file so it may take a little bit of time but then once it's finished you we will see a copy of that Dark Knight trailer on the external SD card of the Galaxy S3 smartphone there you go that didn't take too long so as you can see there rise 3 underscore 720 .mov is now on the external SD card of the phone just to prove that it plays files playing as well. And that's how easily you can use the copy and paste functionality on the Samsung Galaxy S3 and the Android operating system being Ice Cream Sandwich. Any questions or comments that you guys have got, hit them up in the comment section down below there. Hit subscribe from the button up top there. It doesn't cost you anything and it's free and you can check out some of our forthcoming videos. Thanks for watching, have a good day and we'll see you next time.